Hello, precious people of God. Trust you are doing well by the grace of God. We thank God for yet another day to spend time with Him, another day to commune with Him. I want us to take a short exercise, and that is, I want you to click on that like button to help spread this good news abroad. I want you to help us share this good news, and that YouTube will also recommend this channel, this video to others, and they will also be a blessing. Also, let's take a short reading from Job chapter 38, verses 12. It says, Has thou commanded the morning since thy days, and then caused the day spring to know its place? Now, this tells us of the great opportunities, of the great blessings we enjoy as children of God when we speak into our day. And so, it is what we are about to do. Open your heart, be alert, prepare your spirit as we receive inspiring messages from the man of God, Apostle Joshua Selman. Also, if you are new here, hit on that subscribe button for us and then on that notification bell, keep sharing this message abroad, keep sharing on Facebook, keep sharing on YouTube to invite others to join us as we bless the world. You are a blessing. Thank you. I was glad when they said to me, let us go to House on the Rock. I came there and found the oil of my destiny. I've been a prophet for years. But tonight I found it. The ordination. In the next five minutes, I don't know how you are going to pray, but cry. Lord, the grace for the secret place. Number two, the anointing, the mantle and the ordination. Tired of looking like others. Tired of fighting others. Brand my impact by your grace. Place something upon my life. You are in ministry. Cry to the God of heaven. You are a worshiper. Call into the worship ministry. Where is the spirit of David that should be upon you? Oh, thou prophet, where is the spirit of Elijah? We see not the signs. Those outside, please pray. Those online, pray. Here at House on the Rock, Joss. The Lord himself opening men to portals, doorways and dimensions in the spirit. There has to be a way out, oh God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Father, tonight I surrender everything. Lift your voice and pray. Everything. 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 Is someone praying?
everything, oh God. Let it be yours. Yeshua Amashia Komi na na kane Yeshua Amashia Komi na na kane Komi na na kane Komi na na kane Komi na na kane Yeshua Hamashia Komi na na kane Yeshua Hamashia Komi na na kane says nevertheless the foundation of the Lord standeth sure having this seal the Lord knoweth them that are his and he says let every man that named the name of Christ depart from iniquity then he says but in a great house there are not only vessels of gold and silver of wood and clay he says that some vessels are unto honor and others unto dishonor then he says if a man will purge himself that man will be a vessel unto honor meet for the master's use you're going to lift up a prayer lord what in my life must die for me to rise it was in the year king uzziah died that i saw the lord what must die for me to see a higher dimension take it oh god take it oh god lift your voice and pray every flesh every lust every pride that must die tonight Every vain glory. Pray. Let that circumcision happen tonight. That's oh God. Let there be a sign. Let there be a token upon my life. Let something from heaven come upon my life that a generation will acknowledge that the hand of Jehovah is upon me. Patos Kabaranata, Ekretas Kabata Katos, Kaparunsa Katos Kalata, Ebreta Zatela Kata, Ebreketa. Lord, you have called me to be an intercessor. Where is the spirit of grace and supplication? Will it not come upon my life? Kaprande Zakata Brende Ketala Katos. Ela Mashala Marana Masena Maria. Shenata, 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 Nanata. He la branda skata baruka tosha predes. You called me to be a leader. Where is the grace that was on Joseph? The spirit that provides influence. may be weak but the spirit is winning
across this congregation and I'm hearing in my spirit separation 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 there is a grace that is separating people right now separation men and women an ordination is happening in this place an ordination an initiation into a dimension of glory a dimension of grace a dimension of power that prophetic dimension is coming upon you I'm seeing a quickening that prophetic dimension real power not just to talk but to speak the grace the unction from heaven
the grace for genuine signs, wonders, and miracles. Many of the things we call signs and wonders, we should be ashamed of if we look at it from the light of God's word. That the oppressed are genuinely delivered. Age-long captivities vanish within a service. The lifetime of a service is too long for people's captivity to remain. There are people tonight that must drink of that wine. The grace to stand in the office of the Christ and to minister power and life. That when men see you, they rejoice because they know their captivity has come to an end. To appoint unto them that mourn. I decree and declare. Oh God, like the dew of Hammon, someone must catch this case. It may not be everybody, but what? where is that one who has been fasting? Where is that one whose heart has touched your mercy that must carry a grace tonight for genuine signs and wonders? I pray by the spirit of grace, may that mantle find someone right now. May that grace find someone right now. In the name of Jesus Christ. Help that woman please. So she doesn't enjoy herself. Hallelujah. Who is Amos? Amos. I hear a name Amos. Amos. Who is Godia? Godia. Hearing a name go dear, who is that please? What's your name, my friend? Amos. What's your name, sir? Amos. Pastor, can you spare me five minutes? This is called the house on the rock. My friend, I want to pray for you. You love Jesus? I'll pray for you. What do you do? I play football. I want to pray for you. This is more than football. There is a prophetic grace on your life. It's more than football. The angel of the Lord is asking me to stand here. Bring the person here that shouts under the anointing. I want to speak to the person. The power of God is coming on that person now. It's a loud shout. A loud shout to the hearing of everybody. Please pick the person and bring. There is a woman here. You came here trusting God for the fruit of the womb. Please, where are you? A woman. I'm not, I don't know if she's outside. I command that spirit. Now! Let her go now. Did the Bible not say now the Lord is that spirit? And it says where the spirit of the Lord is, there is liberty. Liberty. Let me tell you, except God is not God, what followed you this night must let you go now. This place. Madam, please stand up. Don't cry house on the rock. Pastor, God bless you for putting this meeting. God bless you. God bless you. Every time people are touched, it's amazing how little opportunities like this just take away. Madam, I don't know you, but the Lord, I'm seeing like a towel wiping your tears. And the Lord is saying, I should tell you, in the month of August, I'm stretching my hands towards you because I'm seeing like oil. Hold her please and just keep her down. The favor of God is coming upon your life. The month of August is a strange month of lifting for you. This is what the spirit of the Lord is saying. Captivity comes to an end now by the power of the Holy Spirit. If he is here, 
And if he came, we should know and they should know. I release you. This guy, I'm seeing this guy tied from head to toe. Right now, I declare in the name of Jesus, be released from everything that is not the Christ. I declare it in the name of Jesus Christ. Someone will start running under the anointing. Please hold that person and bring that person out for me now. This robe, right now. This robe, like run, literally, physical, run. I told you, hold the person. Holy fire, burn upon my heart. From the spirit to take. In the name of Jesus, I stretch my hands over this gentleman and I declare, I'm seeing upon this man the spirit of a wanderer moving around and not doing anything. I declare right now by the spirit of grace, be free now and forever. In the name of Jesus, my sister on the ground, I take away what is on your stomach, that, that the devil has put in your stomach to be said in three years that it was fibroid. I take it out now by the Spirit of God. See, let me teach you something. You see, every time God puts meetings like this, be discerning to register your presence. It, 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 even if it's a marriage seminar, if you hear God is coming, come to. Is this man a man of God? Are you, this man seated. Are you a pastor, sir? Please come. Your life is about to change. I don't know you from anywhere. You're a pastor where, sir? It's here, sir. In here, house on the rock? No. Where? A pastor in church. Your, your own church? Yes, sir. What's the name? Fountain of Life Ministries. Fountain of Life. You are a great teacher of the word. But in addition to the teaching ministry, you are entering a strange dimension of the healing ministry. Truly you love the Lord, but I pray for you. Capacity in the spirit. I stretch my hands by the grace of God and the office that anoints and imparts. I release you into this dimension from today. Turn into another man. I set you on fire and I define, I measure a thousand cubits of this ministry and I speak by the spirit of grace. Enter a new season and a new dimension of power. In addition to the grace that will teach, you carry the grace that will heal. In the name of Jesus. Madam, excuse me, what's your name? Hold on. Where are you? What tribe are you? Igbo. You are Igbo? Yes, sir. Ah, I'm seeing an angel giving me a gift. What's your name? Gift to Your name is Gift. That is the gift that God is about to give you. How long have you been married? A year and six months now. And nothing is happening. I lost two, sir. You lost two? Yes, sir. Miscarriage is it? Madam, it's not miscarriages. They happen after the dreams you had. Yes, sir. Huh? Yes, sir. Let's not go into it. But there is a God in heaven. Amen. Just hear me. God is still alive, oh. And is alive tonight here at House on the Rock. There is a God in heaven. My brothers and my sisters, don't get used to your pain. There is a God in heaven. Every challenge is at the mercy of the grace that confronts it. Madam, you believe in Jesus? I want you to shout Jesus as loud as you can. Look at me. Go and prepare. I'm seeing a baby girl. The Lord is bringing it. I declare that the power and the yoke behind this. Make sure you return to testify oh, in the name of Jesus Christ. Let it be over. Tell your husband, look at me. Tell your husband that a man of God at House on the Rock said to tell him he is healed. Amen. Does this make sense to you? Go and tell him. Yes, sir. 
there is a condition he has that he's not even aware of. I must pray for you because it can affect your birth. Tell him that he's healed. Let's just leave it there. Amen. Are we together? In the name of Jesus Christ. You too, my dear? You're married? How long? Six months. Six months. Someone's sister is married seven years, no child. Seven years, no child. You're in the congregation here. Seven years. We're rounding up. Seven years. I, I just felt in my heart to just let God change people's lives this night. Seven years, no child. Please do, make sure you don't come out randomly. Let's have someone just vet them here so they don't. You, are you married? No, sir, my sister. If you come out for food. Your sister, where is she? She has diaper issue. Ah, ah. She has slips. Hold on. They did your introduction and the guy left. <laughs> Who is that? Who is the person? They did your introduction. Oh, people were happy and everything tore apart again. You have now reduced to nothing. Who is that? I need to pray for you now. You are a lady. You are wearing white. Where are you? This is what I'm seeing in the spirit. Who is that? Don't cry, my dear. Please don't cry. Jesus is Lord. You see, let me tell you the truth. People are going through real problems. Real problems. And just because people fake prophecy here and there and manipulate things does not mean God does not reach people. This is, this is one thing that God is raising people to correct. Just because here and there, there are all kinds of things and then there's no soundness of the word and here and there people take advantage of people and manipulate people it should not make you scared of the investments of the spirit it's for the advantage of the saints my dear look at me you're a copper here you came from Bauchi state yes. my god why are they here mama please why is she here your sister, no child, seven years. seven years married, no child. Mama, where are you from, please? I'm from Imo. You are from Imo State. Can we pray for your sister? Yes. What's her name, ma? Emilia. Emilia. In the name of Jesus, here at House on the Rock, we agree as the church of the Lord that after these seven years, she must have a child and give birth like the Hebrew women. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. My dear, where is your sister? What's her name? Hefzibah. She doesn't have a child? How long? Getting to eight years. Three years. She's not been pregnant. Don't worry. Let me talk to you. By the end of this month, she should go to the hospital for a test. In the name of Jesus Christ and by the spirit of the living God. And the dream that she has of a man coming to sleep with her and then everything happens, we declare in the name of Jesus. The Bible says, blotting out every handwriting and every ordinance that spoke against us. The Bible says he nailed it to the cross. We enforce that reality now. In the name of Jesus Christ. Please, why are these people here? marriages fruit of the womb how many of you i just want to pray for you you believe god will give it to you please don't try don't come hoping it will happen or not no no i know you've been prayed for every challenge is at the mercy of the grace that confronts it before you believe a man find out about him jesus christ put his manifesto in scripture so that we'll look at the bible says to minister according to the measure of grace i pray for you in the name that is above all names by the spirit that raised Christ from the dead. My sister, look at me. Shout Jesus. Amen. That's not Jesus. You are shout Jesus. Jesus. She's shy. Don't be. Jesus. Place your hand on your stomach. I'm seeing something tied around your stomach. I lose it now. 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 By the spirit of grace. Look what is happening to her. She was just shouting Jesus. She's not even aware. Ah. The spirit of God. A time will come, church will become like a viewing center. Whether there's service or not, people will come and sit there. 
because they would have learned that there is a residue of the presence of God. Church is not a nuisance to civilization. No. No. In the name of Jesus, I declare to you, regardless of what the medical condition is, by the power that raised Christ from the dead, return with your child. In the name of Jesus Christ. There's one of you here, your sister will have twins. The power of God will come on that person now. No, no, listen, I'm not, this is an exact prophecy. That's the lady. Go and tell your sister that God visited her here at House on the Rock. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus, for all of you trusting God for fruit of the womb, in Jesus' name, return with it. Return with it. There is a banker here. There is trouble in your bank right now as I'm speaking. I'm seeing someone we don't have. There's, I'm seeing an issue that has to do with your bank where you work. And I must pray for you. Please, when I pray for you, you can return back to your seat. We're rounding up. We're rounding up. This is the lady that came out. My dear, look at me. Where are you from? What do you have to do with um, Makodi? I'm from Benway State. You're from Benway State. Jesus, be praised. Let every other name fade away. He has been exalted above every name, thrones, dominions, and every name that is named of things in the earth, of things under the earth. There is a name. There are names, but there is a name. The name of Jesus is not a chant, it's not a charm, it's not a genie. It is a name with an office that backs it. I declare oppression not just over your life but over your family let it be gone like smoke before the wind in the name of Jesus Christ and may the Lord restore you and for all of you here gentlemen um, football is what you do that's all you do where is the pain around your leg which one lift it up how would I know someone put a bandage on his leg? Look at that. Because I looked at that and I saw a bandage and I saw a pain. This came from football. But there is a God in heaven. Listen to me. We'll round up this prayer by praying. If this thing is not on you, don't act like it is there. Pray to come genuinely. Believe God for it. Our generation has too much results to work with shadows. We need to bring the substance of spiritual reality. We need to defend the things that we propose. My brother, you believe in miracles? You believe in miracles? How long has this been? It's been close to two weeks. Two weeks? Yes, sir. Touch it. I bring you the life and the power of this kingdom that we so talk about. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Look at me. Run. Go. <laughs> Jump up and down. Any pain. Look at this. Completely. In the name of Jesus. Any pain. What happened to you now? I'm healed. Completely. I'm Check healed. it. Check I'm it. Make sure you are not faking it. Look at this. Look at this. Lose the bandage. Let every other name fade away. Jesus, thank you, your place.
let all the other names fade away. And the gentleman is even surprised. Stand up, sir. You see, come. I know that you play football, but there is a real prophetic grace upon your life. You understand? This is how to tell people you came to church. You go back and say, I went to church. I went to church. This is proof that he is alive. There is a God that sits in heaven. My brother, look at me. The Lord will take you to a dimension that this that was once a, band, a bandage may it become something that will empower you. Amen. In the name of Jesus Christ. What's your name, sir? I'm Amos, my name, sir. You're Amos. What do you do, sir? Commercial driver for now. You're a commercial driver? Yes, sir. Where? Here in Jos. I want to pray with you. Who is building? Who is building a house? I hope you will not be embarrassed, sir. Can I talk to you, sir? Because I need to pray for you, sir. Um, um, you may not need to come out. Let me just honor you where you are. But I want to pray for you. Ah. You see, Ba, wickedness is real. I don't know this man, but the power of God is coming on you now. This, this our father lifting his hands. An anointing is coming on you. It's called the finisher's anointing. The Bible says, please help him. The hand of Zerubbabel. Why will you start a project and resources vanish just like that? Help the man, please. Because this is what I'm seeing in the spirit. This man starts a project and what the, the problem with him is what is on you. This one raising your hand, come. Are you building? You. Hold on, please. Let me talk to you. There is stand up. The trouble, this guy, you are from Edo State. Where are you from? At those stage, yes, sir. Benin. Yes, sir. That's where the house is. Yes, sir. I need to pray for you. Look at me, my friend. You need to amend your way. Stand up. God is not a herbalist. Huh? Your relationship with God is very... Look at me. Don't feel embarrassed. I'm not here to embarrass you. This is church. Huh? You know what the Bible calls cares. You have to. You see, let me tell you. You are not truly born again till your association changes. There's no such thing as it does not matter. You are either there you are not there period so you, you must summon the courage to edit your relationships by the spirit of God but I must pray for you the kind of speed that will come and look at me receive grace to not be arrogant you hear what I'm telling you I will stop there you see when you say my power and the might of my hands yesterday I taught at our kingdom well summit in this kingdom we don't own things owners are rebels we are only stewards. Whatever you own, you maintain by yourself. This is the cause of high blood pressure. The Bible says, moreover, it is required in stewards that a man be found faithful. I pray for you. There is a grace. Let me talk to him. Give him the mic. Tell me what happened in your dream last night when you slept. I saw you. I, I saw myself in a meeting like this because I'm a copper here in Jos. I don't even know. That's what. Just, just talk I, to me. I, you, I, you saw me in your dream. Yes, I what did. was I doing? But that's not the first time. The last time before this dream, what did you see? Can you remember? You had a dream, and hands were laid on you. You need to be serious with God, my friend. The Lord loves you. But I know you are listening to these messages but you see when you are still rooted in certain aspects of culture they will interrupt your growth process doesn't matter what you are listening to the kingdom itself is a culture and there are certain habits that may be subliminal we may not know we've been environmentally conditioned to reject certain dimensions of God we must embrace God right there are cultures where if you have it you must show it that's how you get respect in the kingdom we are cultured into another kind of lifestyle. 
May the God of all grace help you. Hold my hands. You drink of this grace. You will never be the same. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. Fire is coming on your hands, my sister, the one standing. You don't have to come here. Right there. It's over. In the name of Jesus Christ. We have to round up. One day I'm sure that God will create a greater platform to really be able to minister to his people. Hallelujah. Where is the overflow? Outside. Okay, here, one here. Both overflows. The power of God will come on someone here and someone here. We're rounding up, but bring the person here, please. One here and one here. Wherever, doesn't matter where the overflow is. It's a sign. Please bring, pick the person. The angel of the Lord. Bring in. Please don't rough handle them. Just hold them with honor. And then we're going to pray. Am I wasting your time tonight, Joss? Praise the Lord. Just a few minutes. They've not paid your father. There is some money that is supposed to have come to your father this thing is close to is at least five years this is I don't know whether this is some money that you have prayed you have gotten lawyers the family has where is that person help her. my friend that gentleman raising your hand is that the situation just lift your hand right where you are the power of God is coming on you now and the, the money for your parents, I don't know what is it that has been tied, but in the name of Jesus Christ, we command a release by the Spirit of God. Right now, in the name of Jesus, this is the, the person from the overflow. My friend, that spirit out of him now, by the power that raised Christ from the dead, let his destiny go, I release you now. My God. Oppression is real, Lord. But again, there is a name that is above every other name. It's not just a scripture to recite. It's a reality to experience. Not just you, my dear, but your entire family be free now by the God of heaven. I decree and declare in the name of Jesus, let me tell you this. If there is any family here under the sound of my voice that things are not working for, regardless what you do, you know what I mean? That all doors close. Shakatos kabata. I stand right now by the power of the Holy Ghost. If you belong to that category, at the count of three, as I pray, the power of God comes on you and opens that door. One, two, three. That door be opened now. Be open now. Every closed door over any family. Just I speak to you by the rod of a higher priesthood. Doors be open now. Be open now. Be open now. You cannot come to a church like this. For a meeting like this, the lifetime of your impact should, 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 should last. One service is enough for your life to change. Why should you come with doors closed and go back with doors closed? I say it again. I don't know what has refused to open, but I join my faith with the faith of the servants of God here. I shout it by the Spirit of God. At the count of three, I don't care for how long. Be open now. Be open now. Be open now.
Hallelujah. I want to pray. The Lord is showing me a vision. I'm seeing I'm seeing a cry. Have they appointed commissioners? We are huh? not yet. We have to pray. There is somebody that is the will of God for him to come there. But I'm seeing people try to talk the governor away to remove the name. And it is God's will. Now, I'm, 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 not, I'm not necessarily talking about here. But in the name of Jesus, I declare right now that the powers of the Medes and the Persians will not interrupt the government of Jaws. I speak to you in parables and I speak to you by the Spirit. Hallelujah. We have to cancel death. I'm seeing one of the kings in this land very sick. And if we don't pray, I'm seeing an obituary like death somebody one of the ruling elders one of the local i'm not a prophet of doom please i don't just come and prophesy nonsense this is coming so that god will redeem his people but in the name of jesus we extend his life by the power that raised christ from the dead we expand his life in the name of jesus my dear look at me that rejected stone don't cry that rejected stone will become the chief cornerstone don't let anyone despise you i minister hope and healing to you in the name of jesus christ and that every voice that is not of the christ i declare that it must let you go in the name of jesus any project your hand started that resources just vanished i stand by the power of prophecy and I speak to you. Please hear the word of the Lord. I speak by the spirit of grace. Between now and the end of this month. I stand in the name of Jesus Christ. I decree and declare. Speed over that project now. Who is Yabo? We have to close. Yabo. Y A B O Yabo. Is that a name? Is that a surname? Is that someone's? I'm hearing a name Yabo. Yabo. Uh, that should be Y A B O or something like that. And we want to pray for that person's family. But in the name of Jesus Christ, I'm declaring. I'm still seeing this guy. I don't know if, whether the person is here or not. Every trouble that will implicate you in the bank that you're working in the bank and I'm seeing something that has to do with money missing and they ask everybody to pay huge millions of naira and in the name of Jesus we cancel it by the spirit of God yeah. come again you work in the bank oh I see what bank sir CBN CBN you work in CBN The rod of the wicked will not rest upon the lot of the righteous. He says, lest they dip their hands in iniquity. I pray for you in the name of Jesus Christ. May the Lord himself protect and preserve you. By all means, he will give you peace. Always. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. My God. Sometimes you just check the time. Madam, come. What is wrong with you? If she can't speak English, any language she can speak, there should be some. You're having a spirit attack. Spirit ah, ah, attack. Look at me. I'm looking at you and I'm seeing something joining me and you. Yes. What tribe are you? I'm Taro. The baby will cry. Somebody, a mother or so, help the don't take the child far from the mother. The child is going to cry. Just hold the child. Sorry, uh, young man. I have to pray for you, my dear. Cry. Ah. May God forbid what I'm seeing. 
in the name of Jesus. I'm looking at this woman and I'm already seeing a coffin with a woman inside. This is what I'm saying. Let me tell you the truth. Wickedness should not scare you. Ah, what is... Ah, huh? the boy has been what to come here? Oh my God! I'm looking at this woman and I'm seeing something that has been finished. This is a woman that has died. They've they've covered. The, please don't cry. Cry, Madam. Stand up. This is her. This is the boy. Soul, but the last Adam, a life given spirit, Madam. Look at me, hold my hands in the name of Jesus. I speak to death, it knows my voice. I command it to pass over you right now in the name of Jesus and the authority of witchcraft, the ordinances, the tokens of death. I declare, Oh, death, where is thy sting? and oh, grave, where is thy victory? We decree and declare, and for this young man. May the God who raises men raise this boy. Like Jeremiah, may he become mighty. Like Joshua, may you be a warrior. In the name of Jesus Christ. And everything that is not of God, madam, I speak to you in the name of Jesus. Let it be over right now. In the name of Jesus. Who is Habila? Habila. I promise you a few minutes and we're done. I apologize. Habila. 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 I'm hearing the name Habila. Somebody's father is in Jude. Now, currently, on admission, lying down in Jude. That's just university, um, just university teaching hospital. Jude. We have to pray. I'm seeing. Who is this gentleman? What's your name, sir? Habila, Habila Mark. Habila Mark, yes, sir. that's your name. Yes, sir. Where are you from? From Latu State. Sir. Latu State. Yes, sir. Inamama. Then I Gida. Gida Ina. Uh, Go and tell Mama that in the name of Jesus, she will not cry between now and the end of the year. Amen. You hear what I'm saying? Yes, I will leave it there. It will not be that she will call people and say, "So how can I have fee? We rebuke it now. In the name of Jesus Christ. Ah. I want to pray. Just listen. I just saw a ghastly motor accident. A car and kekenape. This tricycle. These boys. Just negotiating a bend. And it just hit someone. And the person who would have died. The family member is here. The power of God will come on that person now. No, 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 no. It's not a general prayer. It's a specific individual. Now, as I'm praying, God is going to deliver. Ah, ah, hold on, no. This, hold on, sir. I deliver your wife from death. Come. Come. A few, I'm seeing that the devil would have killed your wife. It would have been that by now, you will be a widower. She this, had an accident today. Today. With the Kekena Pep. This is what I'm saying. Kekena Pep. Yes. Where? At, uh, between, uh, just, uh, this wife, where are you? Is she, is she, wife, she's she? around. My wife? Today. She said, oh my God, look at this. Don't cry. Don't cry, my dear. You are before the God of heaven. Look at. And you would have said, how can I allah Sharia? You see what we are saying now? Don't cry, my dear. Ghastly motor accident. Orchestrated by hell. There is a God, oh, there is a God that sits on the circles of the earth. When men vent their pride, he watches in his majesty. If he doesn't act, it's an act of his mercy, not weakness. My sister, please do not fear. There is a God in heaven. Huh? You will live long with your husband. The Bible says... How many children do you have? Two. Children, yes, sir. Two. Only? Yes. Even God for two. Look at me. One, two, three, four. This is what I'm seeing. There's two more. How many children did you plan to have? 
four. So two more on the way. The, I, I, I'm sorry for embarrassing you. Yes. Please. 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 I, the plan is not to embarrass you. Hmm? So, madam, congratulations in Jesus' name. You too, congratulations in Jesus' name. You will never give birth to foolish children in Jesus' name. You will give birth to princes, Deborahs, Esthers. My dear, I declare death huh, will never come around your vicinity in the name of Jesus. Don't be afraid. Look, let me tell you, if death is following you, even if you miss a flight, a train will kill you. When, once you are appointed to death, it's only the spirit of life that will free you. So it's not refusing to enter Kekena Pep. You'll say, okay, I won't enter Kekena Pep or I won't carry anything. No, these things are spiritual. But in the name of Jesus, I minister life to you and I minister life to your husband. I declare both of you. An anointing is coming on both of you and it's a grace for wealth. Receive it now, two of you grace for wealth the Lord is putting something upon your shoulder and he's shifting you to a dimension of increase you can be wealthy and still be godly Psalm 112 blessed is the man that feareth the Lord that delighted greatly in his commands he said his seed shall be mighty upon earth then he says the generation of the upright shall be blessed he says wealth and riches shall be in his house and in spite of it, his righteousness endures forever. Praise the Lord. My dear, in the name of Jesus Christ, I declare that you are free. Free from the spirit of death. By the anointing of the Holy Spirit. In the name of Jesus. Everyone here trusting God for a job. Let's, let's settle this thing once and for all. In the name of Jesus Christ. Uh -uh. hold on please you are a caterer but nobody patronizes you this thing does not work where are you madam come uh, because the woman is crying and I'm hearing her cry in the spirit madam please look at me you cook like you know what I mean by um, what they call them here like for weddings birthdays and you, she yes, does it yes, yet the patronage is not there I'm seeing this woman hold a man walking then I'm not seeing a man again I'm seeing the man gone and only the woman walking you know what I'm, I'm saying I'm seeing two people like wedding now from the altar walking and then later I see the woman walking alone where is your husband Madam, in the name of Jesus, the boy wants impartation. In the name of Jesus, madam, I declare, I don't know what it is that you do, but in Jesus' name, we declare here at House on the Rock, here in Joss, we speak to your business. Everything that is alive grows. Growth is a characteristic of living things. So when a thing does not grow, it means it's not alive. Therefore, we give life and we command growth to be the proof of that life. Let your business grow by the power that raised Christ from the dead. In the name of Jesus Christ. There is a medical person here. You are not, you are not a student, but you are writing and you are about to write an exam. That means you are a doctor, you are a full doctor, but there is an is there is an exam. There's something like that. Am I right? Just correct me if I'm wrong. I'm just saying, uh, uh, you uh, not a, uh, not an undergraduate, please. You are not an undergraduate, but there's... Who failed the one he wrote before? Don't be embarrassed. This I just want to pray because... Huh? He failed the first time. Who wrote in Ghana? Do they write that exam in Ghana? I'm seeing someone writing in Ghana. Accra, Ghana, that's what I mean. Medical... A Nigerian no. Nigerian medical exam but it has to do in Ghana in the name of Jesus Christ don't know where he is but for your brother that that did that that failed it doesn't mean he's dull in the name of Jesus 
we empower his mind and we declare that he must pass you too you are writing the exam you are a doctor in the name of Jesus I decree and declare this will be your first time writing it go and excel in the name of Jesus go and excel we decree we establish it by the spirit of God there is a spirit in man any who said and the inspiration of the almighty can make men of understanding we declare that you will be of quick understanding in Jesus name I pray please madam don't cry madam don't cry in the name of Jesus madam don't cry if, if we're if, if I continue to prophesy here you see we're going to spend the whole night we have to find somewhere and just stop tonight God will bring me again in the name of Jesus Christ and much more than bringing me God will raise many in addition to the many that he has raised so that across the length and the breadth of this city there will be voices when Satan hears no in Bukuru before he gets to Dadinkoa you hear another no and all we will drive darkness even from this land in the name of Jesus Christ may the Lord bless you may the Lord honor you your name is patience but they call you patience It sounds funny, but you know, we will say patience, but they call you patience. Is there someone like that? You are not, don't be embarrassed, you are not very tall, and you are wearing like a, a, a jacket. A, is it a jacket or a, a patience? Outside? What's her name? From where, my dear? From Kaduna. Kaduna. Yes. You call her patience. In the office. In the office. Yes. Tonight, leave this conference knowing there is a God in heaven. Leave this conference knowing. Who banki ji kai kadei kai sayabo lives your life my dear I stretch my hands now and I declare in the name of Jesus that everything that represents shame and reproach that name Ichabod I declare that it lives your life forever in the name of Jesus and for you my dear I pray for you the Lord himself will keep you from evil that prayer lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil is a powerful prayer I pray that prayer for you your innocence will not be manipulated and taken advantage of. In the name of Jesus, may the Lord preserve you by his spirit. In Jesus' name. Let's lift our hands. We have to round up. Father, in the name that is above all names, we thank you for this encounter tonight. You are here. Please drop your hands in for a minute. You are here, scattered across the overflow and right in here. And whilst you saw the Lord move, touching people, blessing people, the Lord began to speak to you that there is need to make your ways right. I believe that people should be born again. People must be born again. Jesus is a serious matter. It's not an option. He said, ye must be born again. You are here, you probably have found yourself in the things of God, but for whatsoever reason, things went haywire and you just know that you need him. I'm going to count one to five. Our time is up. Inside, outside, run like there's fire on the mountain and come and stand here. One. Come in, Anakane. 
There is something called the assurance of salvation. Please make your way quickly. Don't be ashamed. Don't say I came together with my family and then I'm ashamed um, and so on and so forth. Don't, don't allow him, don't allow the devil take advantage of you. He must perfect your experience tonight. Keep coming. You must be born again. The more we have people who are saved, the more we have bodies that God can use to glorify himself. Every one of you standing here, please don't be embarrassed. There's nothing to be ashamed of. Some of you are crying. When he comes, he will never condemn you. He's the spirit of grace and the spirit of love. Lift your right hand and please pray. You're not reciting a poem. Jesus is here. Let it be from the depth of your heart. Pray after me. Say, Lord Jesus. Say it again, Lord Jesus. Tonight, I believe in you. That you are the son of God. I come to you. Just as I am. Just help those under the anointing. This night, I declare that Jesus is my Lord. Jesus, my Savior. Jesus, my King. I receive the abundance of grace and the gift of righteousness. And I declare that I reign. I want to pray for you now. Say after me, I'm a child of God. I have the life of God. From today and forever, I belong to Jesus and I will live for him. Jesus, I present to you the ones you died for. I stretch my hands over every one of you and according to the authority of scripture, I declare your sins forgiven. And I declare that the grace to live a victorious life comes upon you right now. The power of sin, the power of death, the power of the flesh is broken once and for all over your life. And I decree and declare that the grace to walk in victory is given to you. Every guilt, every shame, every pain, every hurt, I declare that it is gone right now. In the name of Jesus, I welcome you to the family of God. And I declare in the name of Jesus, you will go forward and forward and forward alone. Jesus name okay now this is what I want you to do all of you there are a number of you were rounding up please all of you in cons okay I know that there are a number of you now I believe that the officials here will speak to you very briefly you'll be very brief just follow through with them if you need to complete anything please complete it legibly and truthfully remember you are now saved all of you this way in concert, let's honor them as they go. Please celebrate them as they go. Hold on, what's that? She's not well. Okay, mama, hold my hand. In the name of Jesus, I set you free. Whatever it is, whether it is madness, help her. Out, now! Jesus, complete healing for you in Jesus' name. So please drive all, all of them, just let them have in the name of Jesus. Praise the Lord. I gave a prophecy yesterday during the Kingdom Wealth Summit that I would like to say again that there is a mighty revival that is brewing in Joss. And very soon there is going to be a strange move of God the way it was before. 
Our generation has hardly seen a real move of God at a territorial level. But I know by the Spirit of God, with all the ministries that are working, it's not, this is not something that one man will birth. It's going to be a synergy. And that does not necessarily mean working together. It means God himself distributing dimensions of himself and together like a mighty army, something will happen in this land that will cause many to come. It's not only tin and columbites that will bring people. The nations will flow to this region and say God is doing something here. And I pray that the Lord will bless every one of you. On short notice, within 24 hours, you made out time to be here. I decree and I declare in the name of Jesus, you will return with the evidence of his presence. And every other issue of concern, whether I mentioned it or not, I agree with you that it becomes your testimony. And for the members of House on the Rock, we declare that the next level is your prophecy. You will rise from glory to glory in the name of Jesus. Pastor, thank you. Just thank you. The Lord bless you. I believe we can do more than we've just done celebrating God. Please be seated. Please be seated. Please be seated. Please be seated. We're waiting for other brothers who stepped out to come back here. This is how we're going to exit this premises. The, the bus on the outside is going first to all Airport. They need to return and take another route towards Terminus to the University of Jos. It has a particular pattern. So when you get out there, um, be sure to obey whatever instruction is given to you, and the Lord will bless you. Once again, let's celebrate God's servant for yielding himself, yielding himself to be usable. Come on, I believe we can do. Let's show gratitude to God. They give out the gift. They give out the gift. Thank you, sir. Thank you for accepting to come and just be a blessing to us. We're really honored. And we pray that the God whom you serve will do much more than he's done with you, by you, and in you. In Jesus' name. Celebrate him one more time while you take your seats. While we remain standing, everybody please stand. Please receive to bring the service to a close. Dr. Luca, as he comes to share a benediction with us before we leave. Make him feel welcome as he comes. appreciate God. This kind of meetings, they are Kairos moments. They don't always come around. Seasons of divine visitations. Can you bless him for the rapid turning around of captivities? For the release of the blessing. For the release of the spirit. For impartations of graces. Just appreciate him for what you have received. Father, we give you the glory. We give you the praise. In Jesus' name we pray. The Lord bless you. The Lord keep you. The Lord cause his face to shine upon you and be gracious unto you. The Lord lift up his countenance upon you and grant you peace. I bless you with the dew of heaven. I bless you with the fatness of the earth. I bless you with plenty of corn and wine. Let nations serve you. Let kings bow to you. In Jesus' name. Go from grace to grace. Levitate from one level of glory to another. Enlarge the place of thy tent. Let them stretch forth the curtains of thy habitation. Your season of glory has come. Arise and shine. For your light has come. And surely, goodness and mercy are following you. All the days of your life, you shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Peace, shalom, God bless you. Um, Pastor Harry, please, can you come forward? Pastor Harry.
Hello. Scriptures exalt us from the book of Proverbs. It says, My son, attend to my sins. Incline thy ears to my words. Let them not depart from thy eyes and keep them in the midst of thee. As you have listened to this message, we believe that you are going to reap the blessings thereof if you attend to these words as well. That you will keep these words in the midst of your heart. That no matter the circumstance, your eyes are going to be fixed on these words. And as you have been blessed, we will tell you to share this message. Be an evangelist by sharing to others to be blessed. And then subscribe to this channel for us because we have loads of videos. We have loads of content that is going to make you blessed. That is going to set you on course. That is going to set you ablaze. And don't forget to like for us. Thank you.